All right. Uh, part two of this little uh, video about the neural tube. So I left the last picture of what um, the neural tube transforms in around day 30, 27, roughly around there. But it's not a good picture. So what I did was is I drew what the inside of this looks like, okay? Uh, I found this offline. So stay with me as I label it for you. I'm going to put it in different colors so you can get an understanding of what's going on. So pretty much when the neural folds and everything come over top, the neural tube and the neural crest will separate from the ectoderm and they will start forming inside of this little pouch or um, skeletal protection, whatever, okay? So first, I'm just gonna go into coloring. I'm going to keep this the same for everybody. Found my green marker. So here, neural two, okay? Press. Stay with me, everybody. And this little guy is very important, okay? Keep this in mind. This is, I hope I get this right, the Noda cord. Um, this right here has to be present in order for the neural tube formation to occur. You can kind of look at this as um, the start button. If you don't have the start button, you can't, you can't start. Um, so, here is just, this is just the ectoderm, okay? This black line, this black shaded line, is this blue, okay? And then here is our three parts of our cell mine, okay? So here is our anterior, all right? Our anterior is gonna be our, I hope I have that right, which will lead to our vertebrae skull, okay? I'll shade him in for everybody. Okay? Anterior. Now, we have our posterior, medial, however, just posterior is fine. Alright? And he's going to be associated with our Myotone, which will lead to skeletal muscle. So, anterior part of the somite, posterior part of the somite. Okay? And let's go with, I ran out of colors. I'm going to go with the pink again. Alright, and this is going to be our lateral. And the lateral be our dermatome and the dermis. So this big black arrow is just showing you what this looks like in this. And these somites, as you can see, will be all up and down, and this is how they are laid out. These um these other two things right here, this uh this little bottom, I'm not even gonna color it, but I'll label it for everybody. This will be our endoderm, and this, this thing right here, I'll 
color it in just so you can kind of see the what the are here. I gotta look at my notes for this one. This is gonna be our mesoderm, okay? So this these are gonna be two sections of it. So this side is one, this side is another. Let me make sure I got it right. This side right here is our parietal, and this one right here is our visceral, if I got that right. Yeah. Visceral, lateral plate, parietal, lateral plate. Don't pay any attention to this. This was just in the drawing, and I just wanted you to see what they were. So pretty much this is what you're looking at. That whole process of the neural folds coming in is pretty much um, trying to separate the neural tube and the neural crest from the actual ectoderm because um, at the beginning they're all on one thing and then as the folds come together it pushes the neural tube and the neural crest out and into its um, own forms inside the uh, embryo, okay? So, thank you.